Hello, everybody. We are the Wandering Gypsies. This is Enter the Shell Show. And this first song we play for you guys, we call Chastity. <laughs> that you were wearing a Vincent Price t-shirt. Are you, are you a fan of the man or what? Uh, yes, I'm heavily influenced by Vincent Price. I don't know if you can tell, but even the way I do myself is very <laughs> influenced by Vincent Price. <laughs> do you have a Vincent Price impression? Oh, do you, it's really hard to do a Vincent Price impression. I don't think I can. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Is it, yeah, I always think of Thriller. Anytime I think of Vincent Price, always Thriller. Yeah, yeah he had the creepy voice. Yeah, but that was cool. That was the one thing that was cool about him. He had a creepy look creepy voice that made him creepy sexy yeah you know girls really liked vincent price (laughs) yeah uh now uh what have you taken from vincent price um well other than his look apparently (laughs) well just earlier today actually i went to a vincent price museum and uh like he collected like a lot of like 500 bc pottery art like mexican pottery art like ancient aztec artifacts and stuff and I suppose he he felt that uh, that East Los Angeles College deserved to have it. He gifted it to them. He's like, yeah, I guess like you know, give to, give it back to the culture. You know, that's very cool of him. Yeah, I had I, no idea. See, see the fun things that you learned here on the Aaron the Shell Show. Good fun stuff. Uh, who who do you guys like? Uh, do, are you guys in the same camp? Do you guys like Vincent Price? Who are your guys' uh, influences that are not musicians? Not musicians, I'd say, would be, uh, I guess, a lot of art authors of books. Like, I like uh, Paulo Coelho a lot, who uh, wrote the infamous uh, The Alchemist. But I like a lot of his other books, too. He has very uh, a lot of uh, wisdom in the way he writes. And 
That, that's a different artist. Besides music. For me, it's probably gonna be. That's not an art. I mean, not. The appropriate answer to that is you, Turtle. You're my influence. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that was that me. was qu uh, answer A. <laughs> and, and so that's all, that should always be. Now, anytime someone asks you a question, you don't know the answer. I'm always the answer. That should just <laughs> be the way it works. Facebook.com slash The Wandering Gypsies. That is where you can find them at. And uh, while we were uh, getting ready, um, you were out there and uh, you, you were testing out the board. Three point try it, and then if you don't get it, no. <laughs> no ice cream for you afterward. Uh, no ice cream for you after the show. Yeah. Oh, you can't get it, no ice cream, man. Where are you filming? He's like, I'll do it for my fucking ice cream. Just in case it does. Yeah. Do it for the ice cream. Come on. That was when you were really fat. You yeah. like this when I call it ice cream. <laughs> oh, my friends is like literally they'll tell me they're like you land this trick, we'll go get a whopper. And I actually yeah. land the trick. I'm telling like, you all like a big fan of Biki, man. <laughs> like a really big fan. I ended up waiting to go to 214 though, which was bad. Yeah. BK's bad. If you have a trick, we'll get you a walker. Yeah, it's been three days. I've been three times today. Not good. 
So it's been three months since he's been off of board. So he's probably rusty. So no worries. No worries. You get an A for effort. Right? It should or, be an or, E. Or right? B for bitch. <laughs> 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 no, it's totally cool. Back locked. I, I, could, I was never able to do My lower back <laughs> ended up getting locked. So I had to go see a chiropractor, and they pretty much like unlocked my back, cracked it, put me back in place, and then I had to go for like four or five different sessions of physical therapy. So going. Okay, cool, cool. Um, uh, hopefully you recover from that, man. Yeah. yeah, but I can't really do a lot of crazy stuff. Like I can't play soccer still, which sucks. I can, I can drum it, but I can't push it on the running as much. I still have some more sessions. Once the sessions are done, Tell you what, once the sessions are done, we'll have you guys come back uh, just for the trick. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> cool? Yeah, I'm done with that. I'll bring my board. Do
guys are beer pong enthusiasts. We just recently had a beer pong tournament, like not too yeah, long I ago. He, this guy hosted. I hosted the beer pong tournament. Me, me and my friend. It was for his birthday as well. But it was like complete last minute thing. Like we we got everything done within a couple. Of it, it was pretty. It, it was. It cracked. It cracked. It cracked so much the cops came and then the owner had to kick everybody out and then, and then people didn't want to leave. Of course then, not. It's cracking. <laughs> and then <laughs> he had to like literally throw people out and then people were getting all mad and they played no, with no, toothpaste no, in the restroom. No, no, correction. All right. The cops came <laughs> and like only 30 people left out of like everyone that was there. And then they came again. And then after that, like another 50 people left. But even after the 50, 50 people left, there was like a good like 60 to 70 people still there. And then after that, that's when the mom like someone went in the restroom. They got toothpaste. And he started throwing it on the wall and on the floor. And that's when the mom went in there. She's like, you know what? That's it. Too much. Cut it out. So then my friend came and he was all mad. He's like, man, who the fuck was fucking with the toothpaste? And I what kind of toothpaste was it? It was, um, Colgate, the, dude. Another, Colgate. <laughs> I think Colgate. I'm not sure, but it was minty. It was really, really, really Winter minty. Fresh. <laughs> Experiment. But I, I had to clean it up and everything. But like after that, we just, everyone like top of that, like the crowd killed the keg. I mean, the keg died. Like, and wow. they stole the tap, dude. Oh, and they, and they stole the they tap. They stole the tap. What kind of parties are you throwing? There's toothpaste yeah. everywhere. There was, I'm surprised because there was a really huge pool in the middle of the of the the backyard, dude. No I'm surprised no one in. drowned or anything. Yeah, yeah, I was like expecting people to jump in, but I guess at the one same guy was time, talking it was about it, cold. He said if if I did it with him, he would have done it, and that's why he didn't do it. Because <laughs> you didn't want to do it. Hell no! Man. I was gonna <laughs> jump in the water, look like a fool. <laughs> no worries, no worries. Well. Here's the thing about beer pong. Um, I've never been a big beer pong fan because I really enjoy beer. Um, but, I, you know, with beer pong, it's like you, 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 if you're lucky enough to, you know, get a, a ball in there, you're like, yes, I get to drink. So usually, like, I'm, I have a beer, I'm drinking, and then, like, when a ball goes in my drink, then I drink some more, you know, because I'm just like, I, sometimes I got to wait to drink. Like, this is ridiculous. So there's that aspect that I don't like about beer pong. And then there's the other aspect of like, I'm not saying I'm like a clean freak or germaphobe, but it really bothers me about the the ball, you know, because it yeah. gets dirty. Well, here's the thing about the water. Is that like, does water really clean a ball? You know, <laughs> like there needs to be soap, some disinfectant in there. And then it, it's like the the more you put the ball into the water, the dirtier the water gets like, Water doesn't just like clean itself, <laughs> you know. So it's like the the ball is just getting dirty. You're immersing this ball that's like supposed some muddy water, man. Yeah, you're like, oh, it's fucking totally clean. Or <laughs> like sometimes if the ball goes into the grass and the people throw the ball in the grass, the water will be grass. And then when they try cleaning it, there'll be grass on the ball. And when they throw it, it'll land in the beer. Sometimes you look in your beer, you'll notice it's the grass, but you're faded. So you're just like, fuck, you just drink it, you know. Dude, I've played with some people where they just like. Like how you're saying, like, you have to wait to drink. I've had, I've played with people, like, my teammate would, like, I'm not going to drink. You just drink everything, man. I'm like, and we're getting our ass kicked out here. I'm just like, dude, I had, like, like a bottle of, like, whiskey before I started playing, man. And now you're having me drink, like, seven freaking cups of beer. Like, <laughs> look at the person you chose for your team, dude. I mean, come on. Okay, it says yeah, it all. Like, you know, like, don't, don't choose short girls to be your teammate. <laughs> no, just choose the right ones. <laughs> Hey, man, I, I kicked ass with a short girl on my yeah. team last time I played beer pong. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, so man, don't don't discriminate. Too, don't yeah. discriminate. <laughs> she was short and Asian. Oh, oh shit, dude. She Asian put it away, man. The, the most deadliest of the bunch. <laughs> Love it. Love it. So those are, that's my thought on, on, on beer pong. Yeah, I'll play it, but I'll really, I don't know. I, I sh I, I'm only allowed to play beer pong if I'm, like, the first person to play because I know the water's clean. And as long as you give me a few extra beers in my hand just to, like, drink while I'm playing. So, I, I don't know. Am, am, am I, like, a a wet towel or something like that? Or is that I actually, to be honest, I didn't really think about the ball getting that dirty until you actually mentioned yeah. it. I was, like, started thinking about it. I was, like, damn, man. Like, that's sure, that's true. true. Man. Like, 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 the you water does like, get dirty. Like, like why do I go home sick, until, man? <laughs> oh. I'm, like, I, oh, you got to disinfect, like, your mouth and your throat. <laughs> You're, like, oh. When if the water's too dirty, we dump out the water and drunk to nowhere to get more water. We got another beer and we just use clean it in beer. Maybe what you should do is uh, do tequila instead of water. You oh, know because that uh, totally disinfects a lot of shit. Mystery shot. 
They're just That'll like, kill some so dirt. Some, some games, um, no they always have different shit. house rules. <laughs> so for one of the games, they can call it the mystery shot, and it's pretty much um, you don't tell the other team what cup has the has the liquor, but put it in there. Mystery cup. Yeah, mystery cup. The more you know on the end of the shell show, guys. Next time you play beer pong, mystery cup. I'm telling you, we're we're on we're on to some like major things here on the show today. Grave keepers call my name now Got my bottle of 